Hey guys, what's going on? Rob with Three Strong here. Today I want to talk about how to get your hips and hamstrings working um, a lot harder when you do a deadlift or a Romanian deadlift. I've seen a lot of people um, take the deadlift and turn it into more of a squat motion and um, they say that, oh, I really feel it in my thighs. Well, you're not supposed to feel it in your thighs. You're supposed to feel it in the back of your legs, your, your hips. It's a primarily um, backside of the body or what's called the posterior chain. The muscles in the back, the hips, uh, the glutes, and the hamstrings that make up the, uh, that posterior chain, the backside of your body. This is a little trick. See these little plates here? We had a trick for the uh, squats, so you can watch that video uh, to get the quads working. Now you can use the same plates to get the hamstrings working even more. All right, so in a typical deadlift, this is the fault with the deadlift that, that I see a lot, is that people, when they get set up, first of all, they're not keeping a flat back position, and then they get the knees too, too far forward, and then they turn it into this motion. Notice how I'm keeping myself very upright, I'm squatting down, knees are shooting forward, um, and that bar is way out in front when I really want to be in this shins almost vertical position, hips are gonna be between the knees and the shoulders, not lower, and I'm going to use my hamstrings. Feel the stretch, get down. That is what the deadlift should look like. Okay, so if I'm getting down into a position that looks like this, which is not where I want to be, that looks more like a squat than a deadlift. Notice how the shins are vertical in that one. So if my knees are shooting forward, what I want to do is my calves are actually stretching forward, the stretch here, as those knees shoot forward. Well, I want to get myself in a position where I physically cannot do that. Okay, we're going to use our little plates, so grab five pound plates. You're going to get the balls of your feet on those plates, now I physically can't push my knees any farther forward. Plus, with the weight pulling the balls of my feet back, I can't help but stay on my heels. So now when I get set back up in this, in this position, those weights pull my, pull my weight back and I have to be on my heels. Then from there, pull that bar in as close to your shins as, as possible, get that back set, and stand up. So once that back is nice and flat, you will really feel the hamstrings and hips working a lot more. Do not get the weight on the balls of your feet. Don't do that. Just let those heels sink down into the ground, off the end of the plates, and you will really feel those hamstrings working anytime you do the deadlift. All right, grab some plates, give that a shot, see how that feels. See you tomorrow.